Good morning. All right, welcome back to the hangar, everybody. And we have one goal today, and that is to change that relay out of that panel. So we're just gonna jump right into this. All right, so here's the relay that's prepped to go up. Now we gotta get the wires off of the old one that's still up in the airplane, but we're gonna mark all the wires first with wire marking tape. And if you guys have never seen these before, you get these little rolls of tape that have little numbers on them, uh, or in this one's case, it's got numbers from zero to nine. And we're just gonna number those. These two cannot get mixed up because these are the smallest wires with the smaller ring terminals. And then we already have those uh, marked off. These ones are going are not quite as labeled. Uh, I mean, they do have the wire numbers on the wires, but I'm gonna go through the trouble and wire them. So I'm gonna go two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Yep, and mark them before they come off and then we can uh, take that relay out and bring this guy up. So let's go do it. All right, guys, here we go. But I got, we got to first clear these test wires off that we installed last time. So I'm just gonna, those were fork connectors. I'm just gonna take them loose. There we are. So those can, leave we don't need those in our way all right let's get these things labeled One. Um, I think I'm going to need a 3 8 socket on this ratchet, please. There's one bolt there. It looks like it's been open for a while. Yeah, <clears throat> it certainly doesn't. Ready to take wires loose. Okay, got that one. Nice one. Almost got the hardware. I already got it captured. All right. Okay. Got it. <clears throat> Ta-da! There's the first wire that's uh, disconnected. Nice. All right. Five more to go. The washers don't want to come, they don't want to play nice. I'll tell you what, let's get the one, keep it there. I'll get the one underneath it loose and I'll have better access to okay. knock that other one loose. All right, so that one's back on. All right, you can come yeah. off.
<laughs> All right, well that camera went up until the battery died. That one's got a low memory card now too for that. But here's where we're at. We got all the wires off. And now we're now we got to get the four bolts out that hold it to the panel. Only problem is this wire bundle that my fingers on right now is not very flexible and is blocking access to bolt number four. I got one of them out right now. I left the other two, three, and as I was feeling around to the, just to make sure I could get to all four of them, that's when we ran into, okay, I can't get to the number four bolt. All right, so now we gotta come up with something. Me and, well, we have to cut some of these zip ties out of here anyway. So it shouldn't be so many darn zip ties at all. So we may end up not unhooking, but we may end up cutting some of these zip ties. Like that one, these ones, taking the harness clamps loose so we can move the harness out of the way enough for us to get bolt number four out. But that relay is going to stay in place for a little longer until we can come up with a good solution for that. All right, everybody. We've been at this over three hours now just to get to this point and slow and steady so we don't lose anything and we've done good so far up until that wire harness is blocking access to that bolt but um we're, we're likely going to have to move that wire harness out of the way so what we want to make sure is that we're not going to disturb or having to mess with too much other stuff to to do that so we can get those three bolts out that's all that's left three bolts and that relay is out of there and then if we can reverse this process and put the put the put the spare in and proceed on from there. So I really hate to leave this on a cliffhanger, but kind of have to. So thanks everybody. We'll we'll get her. We'll get her there. <laughs>